Hello everyone and welcome to another Unit Forward Moving Picture. I'm Alex, the editor of UnitForward.com and today I'm going to do an unboxing of an Axis unit that recently came out, which is this. The Axis Heavy Anti-Tank Grenadiers, aka the Jag Grenadier and the Lazar Jag Grenadier. So without any further ado, let's get straight into it. So you can see that's the box, that's tactics, blah, blah, blah. You know, these boxes really should have the, the Dust Warfare logo on them as well. Because although you use these units in Dust Tactics and Dust Warfare, it would be nice to, you know, have something on there for to show that it can be used in Dust Warfare as well. So, um, yep, on the back you have, you know, a bit of bit of fluff there, you know, introducing what the unit is. Um, photos, blah, blah, blah. And let's get into it and open the sky. Obviously, you don't need scissors to unbox a, a dust unit. Okay, so that's the plastic off, and let's open the box and have a look and see what's inside. So here we go. And before I go on, I should actually say thank you to um, WorldOfFancyGames.co.uk for um, sending this unit so quickly. Obviously, uh, Unit Forward isn't sponsored by um, you know by anyone or anything. Um, I just want to say you know thanks because it, you know I ordered this on a Friday night and it came on the Monday. So I just want to give a quick shout out to him. And you know if you need dust units, get in touch, and he will more than likely be able to supply you with the units you need. So here you can see we have some cards. Space. Here we go. So we've got Yag Grenadier Dust Tactics card and the Lazy Yag Lazy Yag Grenadier Dust Tactic cards. Um, obviously, these cards aren't used in Dust Warfare; they're used in Tactics. But Tactics is awesome, and you should play it. And anyway, if you buy the revised core set um, and get an Axis or an Allies Force from there, then you'll have. Um, you know, you'll have dust tactics anyway, so you may as well try it out. So anyway, let's open this and see what's inside. Okay, no sellotape, like the uh, Panzer Kampflaffer. Yeah, the plastic seems to have been a bit, but that's fine, as long as the models are in good shape. And uh, here is the first model. And these guys are, I think, the Lazar Yak Genadira. Um, yep, these are the laser. This is the laser weapon team. Get them up close so you can see all the cool details that are on this model. Kind of tricky to paint, I will admit, because they're all kind of bunched up on on the one in the one place, but. Still cool looking all the same. No bendy weapons. You know, some dust models are infamous for you know the bendy weapons out of the package, but on, the, on these guys, no bendy weapons. And the plastic is, um, it feels a bit tougher actually than normal infantry plastic. I have to say, it feels a little bit tougher. It feels more like uh, Walker plastic than infantry plastic. So that's these guys, the Laser Yagandera or Laser Yagandera. And also on the back, of course, there's a Dust Tactics logo on the base. So let's have a look at the other unit in this box, which is the regular Jagd Genadier, the other heavy weapons team. Both these guys are um, Armour 3. And also an interesting rule about these guys is that they count as one miniature. FFG has actually confirmed that the um, each of these weapons teams counts as one miniature for purposes of you know damage and abilities and whatever. So there you can see all the cool details on this model as well. Again, no bendy weapons. Um, the plastic is a lot like the Walker plastic. It's, you know, it's tough plastic. These guys are solid and on the base. Dust Tactics logo on the base as well. And there you go. That is the Jagdgrenadier 
Axis Heavy Weapons Team. So yep, yeah, you get both these guys. Both of these guys come in the box, so you can so you can decide like you know whether you want to take the laser guys or you want to take the non the non laser the ballistic guys, depending on the army list that you are working with. And you know if they were to start shooting at each other, they'd probably look a bit like that. So yeah, though that is an unboxing of the Axis Heavy Weapons teams. Let's put these guys down. There we go. Like that. Yeah, cool. So, yep, that was the unboxing of that. And as usual, um, if you want to find out when, you know, if you want to be informed when the next video is going to go up on this channel, then by all means, subscribe. Um, like the video if you liked it. Dislike it. Dislike the video if you didn't like it. And um, I will see you in the next video. So, until then, see ya.